Guyana is slated to host the championships from September 26th to the 27th at a national track and field facility at Leonora on the west coast of Demerara. But given the current situation regarding the COVID-19 pandemic, it is highly unlikely the event will go ahead as planned. We, we are in constant contact with Consulate as it relates to the South American Under-23 Championships, simply because, um, one, with the present political and economical climate in, in, in the world, the political climate in Guyana, is making it a lot more difficult for us to plan for that event. That, that's the number one issue. Even if we're going to pull it off, so the America would not allow us to pull off, to, to have an event where our country is not completely open up to all countries of South America and them attending. Mm -hmm. So here is the next bottleneck with Brazil showing the kind of um, numbers, you know, um, in, in, of, of, of infected persons and persons with, with infection and um, their, their, their death rate. It's kind of difficult. It's kind of difficult for the plan. So it's 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 not a, it's not an easy task right now. Hutton indicated another possible timeline would be after December first, which would allow athletes who meet Olympic qualification times to attend the games in 2021. It, it's highly unlikely it will go ahead as planned. And, and the other the, 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 the third factor we were looking at having it more done in December. Um, the other factor that is coming to bear, a lot of the athletes who will be coming to the South American on the 23 championships will be looking to um, have performances that going to make them, that's going to qualify them for the Olympics. Mm -hmm. If they hold it um, any earlier than December 4, those results will not qualify them for the Olympics. And that in itself um, is, is, is going to make us push that day back if we're going to have it at all. The AAG had hosted on the 20 championships in 2017, and based on reviews, the majority deemed it to be highly successful. This has enthused Hudson of pulling off another successful feat for this championship. The budget for hosting the championship is close to Guyana $15 million, of which they will receive US 30000 from the IWAF. Athletes from all South American nations are expected to attend which according to Hudson means 300 athletes should be in attendance. For the newsroom, Akim Green.